do you think this one got away? The Pelicans were right there for so much of it. Um, I think they hit, they hit the shots they needed to hit, and we didn't hit our shots. Career high for you tonight, scoring wise. Uh, what were you able to do? Just get yourself going on the offensive end. Um, just kind of get into my spots. Uh, you know, letting my teammates know where I was going to be at certain points, and I mean, they just found me. It seemed like you and LeBron had more on one, one match tonight than you guys did the other night. You know, going against him on both sides of the ball. I mean, he is who he is. Uh, he's an incredible player. You know, I get respect when it's due. And, you know, he hit a, he hit a big shot that helped him seal the game. Do you feel like this one got away from you guys? Like, if you even have an average night shooting, that, uh, you know, this is one you guys should, should be able to take and win? Uh, yeah, I think we definitely should win. Um, you know, we just got to get back in transition defense. LeBron uh, said after the game that he spoke to you and he just wanted to let you know that the future of the game is bright with guys like you and Ja and Trey Young. What does that mean to you when a guy like LeBron gives you that message? And you know, um, you know, it definitely it means something because, you know, he's been doing this for <clears throat> 17 years and his resume speaks for itself. So, you know, for him to say that, you know, it holds something. Um, that's all I can say about that. You guys have had to learn some hard lessons against, you know, some of the top tier teams in the league. Do you feel like you're, you're learning from those teams, gaining from these lessons learned? Um, yeah, I think we're definitely learning from them. Um, I mean, you can't do nothing but win or learn, so... I think we're learning from all our losses. How important do you think it is for a young team to be in these high intensity playoff type environments so you can kind of learn from the mistakes you make? Um, I think it's I think it's great for us. Um, so you know, like if we do have a chance to make the playoffs, uh, the environment won't be nothing new. What's it like for you to be the only teenager, the teenager in NBA history, the first teenager in NBA history, to get 20 plus points in 11 or 12 straight games? What does that mean? Um, I got to thank my teammates and my coach for that. Uh, you know, they trust me and put me in positions to be me, so it's definitely an honor to be in that category. Thanks, Al. Thanks. Thanks.